hello everyone welcome back to my channel my name is lauren if this is your first time here and in today's video i'm going to be showing you my no makeup makeup look so this is going to be without foundation i'll be using only concealer so if you want to see how i get the look please keep watching so before i start anything i make sure that i moisturize my skin really well so i like to take um, the nivea lotion and i like to put it all over my skin i really like this because it leaves my skin looking moisturized but not greasy and i find it looks really nice under makeup so i like to put this on and let it sink into the skin and then I also make sure to take it down my neck too because um, the neck is one of the first signs of aging. So you want to make sure that you're taking care of your neck as well. So after I let my moisturizer get a chance to sink in, I like to go into um, adding glow. So I, I like to use liquid glow for this step. So I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, liquid illuminator. I have it in the shade bronze. I also have um, the iconic illuminator drops um, in the shade original. These are more cool tones. So if you like this, um, if you like to look more cool tone or have a more silvery look to your highlight, this is really good. I really like that. But for my natural days, I like to look more bronze than golden. So I'm going to be taking that just a little bit on the back of my hand and I'm going to apply it to the high points. I really like this because you know you can see that there's a natural glow happening and it's not too much shimmer you know now after I get that all blended I like to go into concealing so for my concealer I'm going to use um, what I used earlier this morning I'm going to use my Fenty concealer I have it in the shade 390 yeah 390 and I'm just going to focus it under right under my eyes where my dark circles are the most pronounced and um, yeah, I'm just gonna do a very little bit because again, the goal is to look like we didn't put too much makeup on. Now for blending it out, you can use whatever you want, but I find that um, if you wanna keep the most coverage, it's best to use like a brush or something like that. Um, so that's what I like to use for these days, especially because like I'll go over it with um, a sponge later to make sure everything's really blended. But um, I find you keep the most product when you use a brush. Now you can see how much that step already makes me look so much more awake and alert. So um, before I do anything else, I want to make sure I set that in place. I don't want to use too much powder um, because I still want to look, I want it to look like skin um, and keep some semblance of a glow. So I'm going to take my Maybelline Fit Me powder and dust it all over the areas in which I highlighted or concealed. Now I'm going to highlight again. I'm going to take the same product I used um, to highlight in the beginning and just put a little bit more on the same spaces. Now I'm going to add blush. This blush is from Dose of Colors. I got it in an Ipsy Glam bag. I don't know what the color is, but it's like a nice peachy blush. It's perfect for the spring month so I'm gonna take it and put this on the apples of my cheeks that just added a nice youthful flush to the skin so I don't really like that oh I have to make sure I set my lid so they don't crease okay now I'm gonna bronze up just a little bit. 
a very little bit. So I'm going to go in with my Fenty bronzer. I have it in the shade Mocha Mommy. And I'm going to take, like I said, a big fluffy brush and just tap in it just a little bit and just add some dimension to my skin. And this step helps in um, taking away from the attention from um, any other blemishes you might have. Most of my imperfections are on my cheek area, so um, that's why blush and highlight and a little bit of bronzer helps out in distracting from you know the dark spots that I have over there. I'm just gonna pop on some mascara. And now for the lips, I'm, you can use any, the joy about this look is you can do any kind of lip that you want, but I'm going to stick with a gloss. I'm going to take this Essence Clear Lip Gloss and pop it on my lips and call it a day. So there you have it guys. This is my no makeup makeup look using just concealer and a few other products. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I um, love a full face of makeup just like anybody else, but you know, on um, there's some days where you just wanna look presentable and uh, don't wanna do all of the extra like, baking and the cut creases and all that. So I find that I use this look a lot when I'm going to work or to church or you know anything like that when I don't want to um, put in that much effort so this is my way of feeling confident and you know approachable <laughs> without doing the most so I hope you guys enjoyed it if it was helpful and you like to see videos like these please give this video a thumbs up and please consider subscribing it's free and it helps me out a lot it lets me know that you guys like my content and it inspires me to produce more and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye